Typically, after a storm comes a calm, but for Homa residents, their life has been anything but calm since Hurricane Ida. In fact, many residential areas are still destroyed and rebuilding their homes months later. It put me out of my house for about three months because the hurricane knocked my neighbor's tree over and took my power box out of my house. So I was out. I went to two different states before I could come back home and I was out of my house for about three months. Also, the destruction has led to piles of debris being found on just about any street corner and city residents living in their cars. Similarly, the city life hasn't been the same as many stores are still closed or under construction. I know that during the hurricane, some of the stores got hit pretty hard and one of them is Ross that my mom likes to shop at and um, my brother used to work at Peppers and it's actually still not open and yeah they've been doing other things I know they lost a lot of workers and my brother has been hasn't gotten another job since so that affected us stores like Ross have just reopened after months of being closed and remain to have visible damage and restaurants like Texas Roadhouse are still providing a limited menu and dine-in time. Homa has come a long way since the storm, but still has a long way to go to get back to normalcy. Reporting for Keeping It Real News, I am Bethany Leonard.